What was the unlikeliest place you discovered a good tiki spot? Oh man. I don't, I've got unlikely spots, but I can't say that they're good because through critique I've learned about some really far-flung weird spots, but I don't get to visit them. Uh, there was one, that, it looked really crappy actually, oh. but it was a, a little tiki bar in super rural northern Italy. And it's just teeny, it wasn't even really a town, it was like a farm field. And all of the kids that played in punk bands for like a hundred miles, or you know, 200 kilometers I guess, <laughs> this is the, the venue that they would play at. I don't remember the name of it. Uh, and it was kind of like almost tiki themed, but it was like, you know, by our standards, crappy tiki bar, like punk music, right. really just like <laughs> bad reed matting and that's it. <laughs> But I totally want to go. I'm, I'm like, right. I want to see what this is all about. And what the hell? I think it's gone now. I think it closed. Uh, and there's a tiki bar up, kind of up in the mountains above Geneva, Switzerland, that has a great big boat in the middle of the bar. It also doesn't look that good or interesting. Still, but I that's want to an know odd more. spot. Yeah. 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 And uh, um, I was at a Chinese restaurant in Wairika, California. <laughs> uh, and, you know, you're in the dining room. It's and, and I always like to, mix, yeah. yeah. And wherever I'm in any sort of restaurant or any sort of older place, it turned out, and I'm always looking to see where the lounge is. Because most likely any restaurant would have a, also have a lounge or a bar area that's a separate area, where, you know. Uh, and so I always want to peek around anywhere. And, you know, I peek around this place and it's all closed down. I guess they might, have, might bring it up and up. But it's like this old tiki bar. Like the bones of it, like some of the things are down, but it's got it, orchids it was, of Hawaii lambs yes, and a like, few tiki mugs, right, I think. And, right. Yeah. Yeah, it was like right out of the probably the uh, late sixties, early seventies mm -hmm. push for uh, yeah, for yeah. your your your, your uh, tiki bar and a book that uh, uh, those orchids did the whole thing. But they were, oh yeah, you could just yeah, you could buy everything: the mugs, the juices, the every syrups, nice. the vermaki. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Um, we have 